Have a great day, son. When you come to Aylesbury Grammar School on your first day, you can expect to make new friends, to uh, study new subjects, and I know from experience that both of these, the boys in the past have found hugely exciting. Parents to choosing a school for their sons are making a big decision. Your son will be known, your son will be looked after, and there will be someone for your son to go to. to achieve something, you can do it, even if the obstacles seem enormous. You really set your mind to it, you can achieve. Ellswood Grammar School is traditionally thought of as being a very academic environment, so the inclusion of drama within the curriculum is serving a, a wonderful purpose. We're now able to see the boys uh, get up onto the stage and express themselves in, in ways that uh, they haven't been in the past. We have this wonderful facility, the new Dame Kathleen Raven Drama Studio. So if you're into drama in a curriculum way, we've got GCSE drama, A-level drama, and also you have the opportunity to get involved in many uh, productions and, and extracurricular work. We have become a language college recently. This year we're a language college. We've got lots of um, activities for languages. We've had a day where people from other schools come to see us and do languages. If you're in primary school, you may not feel very confident about languages, and I would say there's no, no need to be concerned about that. I uh, studied languages here myself as a student, so I can fully recommend them. Well, we'll try very hard to offer a wide selection of different types of foods. All the food that we cook ourselves is um, from best quality ingredients. We're able to offer flexibility. We work with language departments particularly um, to provide German days in October, Oktoberfest, uh, Bastille days for the French department, this sort of thing. We do also have feedback from the pupils. They've recently completed a questionnaire for which we're awaiting their comments as to how we can improve the menu um, and the general eating environment, which is also important, uh, to improve it for them, uh, to encourage them to come and eat more in the dining room. We really value um, sport here at ADS. It's um, a great way to settle into the school in your early years, um, but also as, as time moves on, it's just a fantastic way of of making new friends, building friendships, growing in confidence and we pretty much offer something for everyone. The main sports of the school would be um, the rugby, uh, the football, but we've also got basketball that's thriving. Um, in the summer we have cricket teams out every Saturday um, and athletics um, teams that are very competitive locally and individual students actually representing their country this year in the athletics field as well. When you're new to the school we have an induction session uh, whereby you learn how to use the library, how you may borrow books, uh, where the facilities are, what type of computers and programs are available. In the library we have um, quite a generous ICT facility. We have 15 computers for the pupils, which means uh, in the lower school we can seat half a class at a time. The most important trend in education is individual learning. This starts from when children first start school, goes right through into higher education and beyond that. The ethos of the school, as far as I'm concerned, is one of mutual respect. There's good discipline here. There are a very dedicated team of teachers and support staff 
um, and other support people, I mean, down to the people that provide food at lunchtime. Everybody wants this to be a success. The school has contributed a lot to my son's development, growing from a young lad into a young man now. Um, the respect which people have for each other at the school, I think, has been fundamental to his success. My son has enjoyed all the trips that he's been on uh, during his school life. He's been on quite a few. Um, I think if you were to ask him, he would say the ski trips were his favourite uh, because he's learned to ski, something which I couldn't have done with him. We had two weeks out in South Africa um, playing both rugby and squash fixtures. Um, very successful on the field. We won seven from eight of our, of our rugby matches, um, so we're really pleased with that. And um, the squash teams as well found it uh, surprisingly easy and um, only had a couple of tough challenges in their fixtures. Um, so success on the field for sure, but off the field as well. I think everyone got a lot out of the tour. Um, fantastic experiences in another country, uh, different culture, different lifestyles. Um, weather could have been better, but uh, a real success and uh, lots of very fond memories to look back on. By the time that they leave, most of our, almost all of our pupils stay into the sixth form, do their A-levels, go to good universities, and uh, have a wide variety of uh, professional jobs. But most importantly, when they come back to us, either soon after they leave, or in some cases, uh, years after they leave, what they have is a fondness for and memories of their time at Aylesbury Grammar School. Right, have a great day at school, son. See you later.